Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Toxic Electricity and we're here to talk about a subject of toxic electricity and that is household smoke detectors. In particular, ionizing smoke detectors and these three smoke detectors are all ionizing smoke detectors. And this one has had this plant growing next to it for approximately a year and this one has been growing next to these two for approximately a year. And this is how they look. So these are Diefenbachia plants and the Diefenbachia typically has leaves the size of your hand. So you can see that these leaves are miniature. Now, in my home, there are radio fields that deform the Diefenbachia. So I actually get something similar in my controls that I grow around the home away from smoke detectors. But the interesting thing about these particular Diefenbachias is that the growth is a little bit better than my controls. Uh, the leaves on my controls tend to be a little bit smaller and have less patterning. So I am actually of the belief, having seen this experiment run for a year now, that the emissions out of these smoke detectors are actually enhancing the growth of the Diefenbachia in my home. And this is commonly reported around radio frequencies. Certain radio frequencies will also improve the growth of plants. And I actually see that in other experiments where I actually give my plants radio frequency treated water and it enhances the growth of the plant. And they look quite similar to these. So my conclusion with these household smoke detectors in this experiment is that the emissions coming out of them from the radiation source, there's no batteries in these detectors. So the only energy that can be coming out of them is from the radiation source, which is americium. And that little bit of energy that's coming out of the americium source appears to actually enhance the growth of the Diefenbachia at my home. And that was an interesting finding of this experiment. I hope you enjoyed the presentation and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.